Oh. And, okay, is it on the cards now? That's the question. Rook takes pawn. Magnus, he's allowed it to happen. If Rook takes pawn, maybe, is he going to ignore that? There's some counterattacks against the White King. And, okay, now the Black Knight has stepped back. He defends everything. Uh, no sacrifices available. And White's Rook's looking for those open files. Can he plug that open file with his knight? With the Black Knight? He's going to have to. And um, Magnus now under 20 seconds. Oh, and we see a cross next to Magnus's move. That means a missed opportunity. Maybe there was something stronger. Well, maybe now rookie two can be unpleasant or at least uh, fighting. Fighting for something from White's point of view. Rookie two on, on the, board. the board. We're going to see the rooks leave the board. Knight comes in. Yeah, and Black's Knight has lost a lot of power with that trade of rooks. Now it's going to be incredibly tough to stop White's rook from infiltrating later, but he's using his king, Magnus, aggressively. It's going to be a race, simply. And who's ahead here? Black's pawn's running. Um, Black's pawn is really running. But the A pawn is so close. Well. White's rook has to get greedy here, simply has to capture the pawn and hope for the best. Shaq's being accurate so far, as mentioned there in the feature chat, but is it enough to win? Black's pawns are so fast. Yeah, but after C2, yeah, this was a smart move, I believe. Very smart. Covering the promotion square, so now Black will simply threaten to push his pawn. It might cost White his rook, unless now he abandons the, the defense of his A pawn. Seven seconds for Black. Yeah. <laughs> Magnus, he's got a one second increment now, but <laughs> that's no luxury. It's uh, not enough one second over the board. Okay. White's going to move his rook. Very tricky position. What's he played? Rook C2, but that gives up the A6 pawn. He gives up the A6 pawn, and look, his pawns are running now. Shaq looks away, even at the cost of the Black Knight. Magnus is going to win the game. The pawn's too strong. And he won the game with five seconds on his clock. And uh, once again, Magnus wins the Armageddon match. The Armageddon King. He is the <laughs> Armageddon King. He can take solace in that, but he's still yet to win a class.